assalamu alaikum in this video tutorial we are going to discuss gluconeogenesis gluconeogenesis is the process in which new glucose molecule is formed from non carbohydrate compound the major precursor of gluconeogenesis which initiate the process of gluconeogenesis are lactate pyruvate which are the end product or by product of the process glycolysis glucogenic amino acids glycerol these are the major precursors of gluconeogenesis which initiates the process of gluconeogenesis location of gluconeogenesis gluconeogenesis mostly occurs in the cells of liver and in some extent it occurs in the cells of kidney but mostly it occur gluconeogenesis occurs in the cells of liver about 1 kg of glucose is synthesized every day in the liver cells and inside the cell the initial first step of gluconeogenesis occurs in the mitochondria and rest of the steps of gluconeogenesis takes place in the cytoplasm of the cell importance of gluconeogenesis gluconeogenesis occupies a central role in the metabolism and its continuous supply of glucose plays a wide role for the body to perform various functions for example human brain and erythrocytes red blood cell requires only glucose as a source of energy neither protein nor lipid they require only glucose as a source of energy human brain alone requires 120 g of glucose per day in anaerobic conditions for example a person performing heavy intensive exercises uh, the skeletal muscles of human body requires a great amount of glucose to fulfill its energy needs in fasting conditions for about more than a day gluconeogenesis process must occur to meet the basic requirements of the glucose and to maintain the intermediates for citric acid cycle this is essential for the survival of human gluconeogenesis closely resembles the reverse pathway of glycolysis however it is not a complete reversal of glycolysis three steps of glycolysis which are irreversible requires special mechanism or specific enzymes to to be reversed these steps are step number 1 step number 3 and step number 10 these three steps are irreversible in glycolysis and these three steps requires special mechanism and specific enzyme to be reversed in gluconeogenesis the rest of the steps of glycolysis are reversed by the same enzymes which are performing their action in the glycolysis they are simply reversed by the same enzymes but the uh, steps number 1 step number 3 and step number 4 step number but the step number 1 step number 3 and step number 10 requires special mechanism and a specific enzyme to be reversed in the in the gluconeogenesis for the reversal of pyruvate into phospho enol pyruvate pyruvate carboxylase enzyme acts on the pyruvate and converts it into oxaloacetate this process occurs inside the mitochondria of the cell pyruvate carboxylase enzyme acts on the pyruvate and converts it into oxaloacetate and then oxaloacetate passes from the mitochondria of the cell into the cytoplasm and in the cytoplasm phosphoenol pyruvate carboxykinase is present phosphoenol pyruvate carboxykinase enzyme acts on the oxaloacetate in the cytoplasm and converts it into 
phosphoenol pyruvate in this way pyruvate is reversed into phosphoenol pyruvate and then phosphoenol pyruvate is converted into 2 phosphoglycerate by the same enzyme which is present in the glycolysis pathway enolase enolase reverse the phosphoenol pyruvate into 2 phosphoglycerate rest of the steps are the same as glycolysis but in the reverse direction now the second step which requires special mechanism to be reversed is fructose 1 6 bisphosphate fructose 1 6 bisphosphate is reversed by the enzyme fructose 1 6 bisphosphatase the enzyme fructose 1 6 bisphosphatase acts on the fructose 1 6 bisphosphate to convert it into fructose 6 phosphate in this way fructose 1 6 base phosphate is reversed into fructose 6 phosphate and the last step is glucose 6 phosphate glucose 6 phosphate is reversed into glucose by the enzyme glucose 6 phosphatase glucose 6 phosphatase is the enzyme which is present only in liver and kidney this is one reason why gluconeogenesis process only occurs in the liver and kidney because glucose 6 phosphatase enzyme only present in the liver and kidney and this is an essential enzyme for the process of gluconeogenesis glucose 6 phosphatase enzyme converts glucose 6 phosphate into glucose in this way glucose is synthesized from a non-carbohydrate pyruvate